Hey, welcome back to Rob's Garage Woodworking. Um, I've been kind of absent on my channel for a little while because we've been fixing up um, our house to sell so that we could buy a new house, which we have. And this is not really new, but it's new to us. So um, anyway, we're ripping everything apart. So I'll probably give you some before and after pictures uh, when I eventually have time to make a video. Um, so anyway, right, down, right now we're down in the basement and this is like we're in a side split now and as you can see out the window there so it's got a really big window so it's got a nice lawn and everything and uh, it's a fixed rubber kind of I could have just moved in I suppose but that wouldn't be like me so anyway over here you can see they've textured the walls and I'm not sure the whole technique here but it looks like they put like some plaster on it and then they did like a, a brush stroke with like a glaze and stuff. It's pretty neat. And then as we're tearing this apart, because, well, I'll show you the floor in a minute. But what we've discovered in tearing things apart is that behind it is this, uh, what do they call that again? Wood paneling. Wood paneling, yes. It's been so long. So wood paneling. So they just covered this, this wood paneling over with this really neat textured effect. I've never seen this before. But it's, it's, well, if it looked good, it'd be cool. I just don't like the way it looks. Some people might think, wow, that's awesome. So anyway, I'm showing you that. Now, here, another thing that these people have done with the floor is they put in this floating floor, this laminate floor, right? But when you install laminate floors, you use spacers. So these are the spacers. What you do is you, you make a nice straight line on the floor and you have it all spaced out nicely. And after you install the floor, the important thing is to do what? Remove the spacers. If you don't remove the spacers, your floor will buckle. Anyway, so next thing these people did, come on over here. <laughs> I think the uh, people had just uh, wanted to um, just sell quickly and they just covered it up. But there's under pad here and you really shouldn't put that on top of under pad because your floor, even though it might be a little bit warmer, it feels kind of spongy and over time they open and close the joints. And so it can actually break the joint. So you don't really want to do that. Anyway, so we've got some investigating to do here because it's a little damp and I'm not sure if there's a reason that it's damp. Well, there's obviously a reason, but I'm not sure what that reason is. So we've got to investigate and find that out. Anyway, so that's basically it. Um, we're tearing everything apart. Well, not everything, but a lot of things. And we're moving in tomorrow. So. We're just pulling everything up, then we're gonna move everything in, and then we're gonna start the renovation process. Anyway, thanks for watching.